Oh. Hello? Hello? Zach! Oh my god, we're back. Oh my god, we're back. We're back, we're back. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're back. Oh, we're back. Okay. My internet crashed. I don't know what happened. Uh, uh, is it back online? Uh, yeah, it's back. I, the stream's, the stream's back up, I think. I, I don't know what's going on. <coughs> uh, it says that the stream's still going. I uh, don't see it. That's because it's unlisted now. Oh, God. Everything else is still the same. Uh, I think, I think we're, I think we're properly back. Are we, are we back? Oh, okay, we're actually back. People are in, back in chat. Okay. 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 Oh my god. I'm so sorry about that. I'm so sorry about that, chat. I don't know what the hell happened. Normally, normally this doesn't happen to me. There's eight, uh, 39. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tweet about this. Yeah, tweet, notify the Discord, yada yada yada. Oh god. My internet has never done that. I'm so pissed off right now. I'm like actually really angry about that because now it's gonna be split up into two streams. Now it's gonna be split up into two different VODs on my channel. I didn't want that. Uh, uh somebody said I gained separation anxiety. Don't do that again. I literally had no control over that. I'm sorry, my internet crashed. Like, literally my my internet on my whole computer crashed. I couldn't do anything. Now you know how I feel when I stream. <laughs> it constantly happens for me, bro. Uh, that's so annoying. There we go, I pinged the Discord server. God. Looks like everything's working now, though. Okay, okay, let me, let me pull the chat back up on my phone here. Sorry about that again. I did not want to have to put up with that. I'll give everyone a second to come back. Fuck, dude. Now it just keeps trying to say, it, tell me it's a VOD when I go to check the chat on my actual <laughs> phone. Why? Why? I don't know. My internet's just, my internet just became shit for a second. But we're back now. I didn't progress at all, don't worry chat, I don't even remember what I was talking about, I'm very sorry about that, that's so infuriating to me. I did not want to have to put up with that. We're playing hide and seek now with Heidi. Very funny that the Ooh. person who wants to play hide and seek's name is Heidi. What if I, what if I screamed in mod chat for a second? I, I see their, I see their live in the mod chat. <laughs> I mean if you want to. Where the hell is she hiding? She's probably hiding in one of the actual, like, <laughs> hiding objects. Atiyah's returned. What happened? My, my internet crashed. I'm sorry. I had no control over that. I'm really, I'm really frustrated by that happening. <laughs> Lily, we're back. Thank God. Okay. Where... Where is the girl? Oh, I can hear her. I can hear her laughing up here. You hiding up here? Oh, we found a tape. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back. Vale said, are you enjoying discount Bioshock? Yeah, well, Vil can fuck off. <laughs> Vil doesn't like letting me enjoy things. Clearly. With how much she spoiled Chainsaw Man. <laughs> oh. 
some compensation for They're originally gonna like straight up kill him, but this is this is the compromise. Yeah, exactly. Also, thank you so much for the compensation. No, yeah, like so their original plan was to kill Bendy, but they realized it was literally impossible. So they had to restrict him to the little baby bender body that we see him in now. That's very interesting. Oh, 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 I could hear Heidi laughing. Where the hell is she? In the trash? Maybe she's up one of the up in one of those. Oh, she's definitely up there. Does if somebody asked? Does Baby Bendy have a venom voice? Oh, I, imagine I don't think the baby talks at all. Special, eh? Ah, ah, don't touch me! Can it please be like invisibility for the watchers? Fast? Interact with linker pipes to fast travel between two specific locations. Darker places you've already been to may now hold new secrets. Oh, what? that is actually amazing! She gave me friggin- Fast travel? She gave me fast travel! Imagine if you had some fast travel in the original Bendy. Holy shit. Oh my- And I'm back here! Oh, that is actually so helpful. So if I go back- It's so- It's so bittersweet seeing that area now that, um, our boy isn't here. Yeah, now that our boy isn't here, we don't have any fun lo-fi beats to listen to. It's a liminal space. Oh, that fast travel is so nice. I'm so happy to have that, because Bendy's such, like... Especially this version is so big. Somebody called him the Stink Demon. The Stink Demon. This is a new area. The Keepers have been ta have taken my friend, locked him away like some animal, just because he's big and strong. But they don't need to fear him, no. If they make sure to feed him on time... Big Steve! <laughs> Big Steve on her to fly. He loves the food from the Little Devil Lounge best. If only someone could take the long road back through the sewers, climb up the elevator shack and seek out his favorite thumping delicacy, then they could see how harmless he really is. That seems like a lot of work. Okay, yeah. Killing, we're killing them. We're I'm killing, killing them. every killing single them. one of them. They hurt my baby. He didn't deserve that. We're gonna have 
gonna go full stamina. Why would they do that? Those pieces of shit! Oh, 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 you do not hurt my baby boy! Whoa, whoa, hi there. You must be Big Steve. Hello, Big Steve. You were in the trailer. Hi, Big Steve. Oh, that is just... Mind if I... Oh. Yeah, okay, so Big Steve's a big side quest. Yeah, I'm not going to hit Big Steve. That would be a bad idea. Oh, I'm ripping those bastards a new one. Oh, they won't like me. You pissed off a father. You and a mother. You motherfuckers. You. You and your stupid little beacon head. You and your pride and your ego. You just had to go and fuck it all up. You just had to be the guy. <laughs> I like it how after we said that somebody in chat just went, Jesse! 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 <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Henry? Henry? Sir? Can you hmm? help me? Henry! You must be <gasps> really lost to be asking me. That! What? Henry! What? That's Henry! Henry! Looking for answers. Henry! Keepers, Wilson, the cycle, anything could help. <laughs> Give that projector in the glass a good double smack. Honestly. What? It's Henry! Whoa! His name is Henry. Henry! My mom got mad at me when she heard you swear. LOL. They lock you away. Forever. Still, it's giving me time to think. Things like, if you haven't eaten in years, you might not be human. Why would you be a threat to them? I'm what they call a cycle breaker. Once upon a time, I knew how to start the cycle over. And when that happens, everything begins again. Completely. Whack the projector in the glass I'm case for an Easter egg smile. I don't want that to happen. How did you do it? Reset the cycle. Turns out the ink demon himself is the key. This world is his. But even he must obey its rules. For now, at least. If you can get him to look at something very specific, Said everything. What is it? It's just a reel of film labeled with the words the end. I can see it in my mind every day. They keep it upstairs in the pit. Oh. I'll see if I can break in and steal it. Maybe if I reset the cycle, we could make things better for everyone here. And what about you? I just want to go. So did I. Good luck, Audrey. If you need me again, you know where to find me. Oh my god! Henry! Subject 414? Okay, okay, Lyra, do you know why this number's so cool? No. When you, um beat bendy chapter five and you go back to the start of the game if you use the seeing tool 414 is the number of tally marks that henry put on the wall that you can see with the seeing tool before he stopped keeping track of how many times he's been through the cycle oh that rocks 414 is how many times he went through the cycle and actually tallied it if you go back to bendy bendy and the ink machine the original game 
You can you can see there's 414 tally marks. That's oh my! I can't believe God. they just casually did a Henry face reveal. We just casually just see ben, like not Bendy Henry's face. Like oh my god! And that uh. explains that it did I ask? Fuck off! Um, like that that explains the ending of Bendy so well. The Ink Demon, the Ink Demon controls the cycle. The Ink Demon, this is the Ink Demon's world, and it was built by obeying the Ink Demon's laws. And by showing it the end tape, it almost like it's brought back to the past. Oh shit. It almost gets brought back to the past, and like, by doing that and remembering, it goes back and restarts. That's so interesting. Oh my. This game literally changes everything about the way we view the original game. This literally God. changes everything. In the best ways imaginable. Also, there was a lot of super chats that I missed because I was trying to listen. Whack the projector in the glass case for an Easter egg. Give that projector in the glass <laughs> a whack. Hi, Pistra. My mom got mad at me when she heard you swear. The stream crashed before we could finish. I'm gonna have to pick it up again tomorrow. <laughs> Ah! Thank you, thank you for being here. Also, apologies for your mom getting mad at you when I swore. I'm a passionate man. Oh! That's the projectionist said. That's not any old projector. That's literally the projectionist said. It screams when you hit it. That's actually that's actually what's left of the projectionist. That's fucking cool. Oh my god, it's literally just his decapitated head. Oh, that's so cool. Henry! 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 God, this game. Oh, this game. I yes. reckon I think Phil Morgan might actually like this game. I think so too. Maybe. I think I think I think there's hope. I'll be on I'll be on stream with him when he plays it, so I'll be able to see firsthand. Oh! Oh my god! Bertram! Bert. Bert. Oh, and his eye follows you! Fucking Bertram! Oh my god. Giant ink tear. That's so fucked up. What other characters from the original Bendy are here? There's gotta be- Cause the projectionist's head is here from when Bendy decapitated him. What's left of Bertram's here? There's gotta be other characters, right? Who else is here? There's gotta be other people in here, right? Did something open up? <laughs> There's gotta be other characters in here, right? Pastra, I noticed that Henry had a limp when he walked back to his seat. You're right, Henry did have a limp when he walked back to his seat. That's interesting. What did that open? Did that just open the way to the pit? Uh I wanna. I want to explore this place a bit more. I feel like there's other things here. Oh, the seeing tool! The seeing tools. They locked up everything from the old cycle here. And and your and your axe. Yeah, and your old axe. What? Are you worth? Are you worthy to walk with angels? Alice. Alice. Alice? 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 Hello? Alice? Hello? Bang on it! Bang on it! Bang! <laughs> Alice? What? Huh? Break her out! <laughs> get my girl out of there! Claire, get her out! <laughs> oh, are there any other rooms? Is this where I came from? I think this is where I came from, right? Yeah, this is where I came from. 
Oh my god, this area is insane. Fucking hate that enemy. Oh, oh, subject 418. Oh, there's gotta be something else in here. Who's in here? Who's in here? Sammy! Huh? Sammy! S Sammy! Sammy! Oh my god! Is he just- does he just stay in there and play his music? So Wilson literally contained everything from the previous cycle that could stop him from having control of this world. Every single character that made it difficult to keep control, Wilson locked up. Oh my god, this area is so cool. I'm still freaking out over this. Like, oh. Is there something in there too? Wait, is there something behind you? Ah. Oh my god, this is insane. This is so crazy. Fucking Sammy's this here. Is nuts. Sammy's here. Henry's here. The projectionist is here. <laughs> Bertram's god. here. Alice is implied to be here. Oh my god, I need. Oh, this game. Oh, this game. What the hell's gonna be in the pit? What the hell is the pit? Okay, but like, Alice isn't in there, though. Right? Like, either Alice is far back in there, or Alice is straight up not in there. And we saw Alice in the trailer with a Tommy gun. Fresh milk. <laughs> Free my man Sammy, he ain't do nothing. Free my man Sammy, he ain't do nothing except be racist. And you were fine with that, chat? We're fine with that. Oh, I'm so... Alice definitely escaped. Alice was not in there. It's the Alice pit. Oh shit! Oh, they're so creepy. Oh my, whoa. This game keeps throwing curveball after curveball. What? Oh. A savior comes at last. We're in here with Wilson? Wilson? Oh God. Rest yourself, Audrey. You're still weak. The keepers can be relentless to strangers. But there's nothing to fear as long as I'm with you. You're safe now. You did this to me. You brought me here. Turned me into this, this thing. This doesn't make sense. I've never done anything to you. Open your eyes and look around you. None of this makes sense. Drawn walls, nightmarish creatures, an ancient studio that died out almost 30 years ago. It's all fiction. Utter nonsense. And yet, in here, it exists. It breathes. It flourishes. Reality, guided by its master's pen. The foundation for a new reality. We can bleed into our own. Just think of it. Anything we create in here, we can release out there. What? But first, 
This world must be controlled. Made safe. These things, these angels and demons, are they really life? Or are they just stains? Old mistakes ready to be cleansed away for newer, greater things. What do you want from me? I need your help to save my father's life. What? What? This is our star. What? We'll talk more once we're safely inside. Save? What do you mean, save? Chapter 5, The Dark Revival. This has to be the end. This has to be the final chapter. Wait. Wait a second. What? Henry isn't the real Henry, so he's stayed the same age forever, right? Right, yeah! Stay close. In the real world, Joey w got to be an old man and he died. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. If Henry was already an adult 30 years ago... No! No. No, 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 no. Are you, are you saying that he's Wilson's dad? I don't know, man. Oh, God. This is fucked. I think, I think we're at, like, we're at, like, the end of the game, though. Like, this feels very much so, like, the end of the line. Oh, my... So, Wilson... Wilson's been using the ink machine to try and contain it to bring his father back or save his father? Old Track 77 is a quiet place these days. Ever since that terrible crash a few years back, people don't like to hang around. Too many strange things keep happening on this platform. Last week, one of the railmen told me they had to, they had reports of some train going through that wasn't on the schedule. There were figures standing in the cars, staring through the windows, but it never stopped to let one off. Just kept on going straight through. Some say it was the Silver Lane Express, the train that crashed. Oh... <laughs> that is a fucking what? haunting ending to that. That's unnerving. Oh. <sighs> this game is really good. This game is fucking awesome. The demon's evil continues to spread. This world has begun to shudder. Be quiet. What did you say? Nothing. It was nothing. Hmm. Almost there. Just a quick stop. Won't take but a moment. What? I actually, like, I don't know what Wilson wants. I actually can't tell if, like, Wilson... Is very much so like the villain, but stand in the designated location. Okay, Jesus. Lethal object detected. The subject will submit all weapons for further screening. Disarm them. Oh, there's the Tommy gun from Chapter 3 and the axe. Remain still for examination. Steal the Tommy gun. Shoot him. Shoot him. I don't think I can. The subject is cleared for entry. Yeah, no, I literally can't. Oh my... I'm like... I'm so fucking, like, nervous right now at what's going to happen. Welcome to the civilized world. How do you like my signal towers? They nullify the ink demon's powers so he cannot pass them. I wish I could say I invented them, but it's... 
seems our friends at the Gent Corporation had a demon problem of their own long ago. Wow. Oh. Interesting. Oh my god, look at the fucking painting! <laughs> Hi. And now, my dear, if you'll excuse me, I have a lot to prepare. We'll talk later, I promise. Besides, you must be very tired. A quick rest will do you good. Betty will show you to your room. She's my housekeeper, among other things. Am I, what, what does that mean? You never actually I think I know. Man, did you? No, he's too powerful to destroy. So we sealed him away, trapped him in a different form. One that was smaller. <laughs> Bendy. Everyone says how Bendy is evil and while that is true has just been put through so much that he uses everyone around him like stress toys. But enough talk. We'll deal with that soon enough. There's some nice fresh blankets all laid out for you. You'll be dreaming in no time. Wait, Wilson? One more thing. If you needed my help, why didn't you just ask? <sighs> Would you have believed me? Come no, on. I actually can't Can tell. I actually yeah. can't tell if Wilson's actually like a like a piece of shit or not. Cause like this is very um over the top and god complexy, but like I'm wondering what he means about his dad. It's so exciting finally having you with us. Now, to give you some bearings, we're currently standing in the south wing. Wilson's laboratory is downstairs. And then there's the north wing. Oh, jeez. The ink demon got in there a while ago. And ever since, we've had to keep the north wing locked up to it. I'm afraid it's falling into ruins by now. Oh, jeez. Those juicy, lovely books gone to waste. Only keepers go there these days. And they'll tear you apart limb from limb if Wilson isn't with you. So, mind your distance, and you'll be just fine. I'm just like, I'm just like so mesmerized by what's going on right now, like. It's not very often I have guests to look after, especially one I can actually talk to. Almost everyone here either can't speak or they're completely mad. That's a thing from the trailer. All right, here we are, the best room in the house. Oh, wow. You should see where I sleep. <laughs> but this room, oh, just perfect. I saw to every detail. Bed is clean, the bathroom is on the left. Sorry about the stains. I did try my best to get them out. Oh. Did you have any questions? Is it always night here? It's always dark, if that's what you mean. For as long as I can remember. Are you very old? No. As far as I understand it, I'm something quite new. Although, I didn't turn out the way I was supposed to. One in a long line of failed experiments. Oh. But Wilson will keep trying. And do you? Trust, Wilson? This is the realm of the ink demon. The shadow hangs over us all. I don't trust anyone. But Wilson takes care of me. Keeps me safe. He once said I remind him of something he called his... Mother? Tell me, is that a good thing? Where you two are from? I'm not sure. I don't think I ever had one. Well, no matter. Now, I, I was told to make sure you get some sleep once you got here. So get nice and comfy and relax. I left something on the table that might just help you nod off. 
It's my own recipe. Works very fast. Just follow the instructions. Carefully. Oh, jeez. This whole thing is creepy. If you need anything else, I'll come straight away. I like her. Always up. I like her, too. She's one of my favorites. Smiley face. <laughs> this is not giving me the right vibes. Gilson. What's a Gilson? It's girl Wilson. Still weird just having a reflection. It's yeah. girl Wilson. Oh, I am on the toilet. Nice. Press E to fart. <laughs> Imagine. Holy shit, you took a piss. Nice! The ink piss. <laughs> Shut up! What else would it be? Where's the Gilson? Where? Why are you blue? <laughs> I love that moment so much. <laughs> Why are you blue? Oh, then I'm just sitting down. My name is Walter Hartwell White. I live at 308 Negra Royal Lane, Albuquerque, New Mexico, age 7104. This is my confession. Oh, I, I like Bendy. <laughs> <laughs> I like Bendy and the ink machine, and I. Wow, that's a lot of. Yeah, I, oh. I ain't reading all that. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I already know that. And the and the ink machine. Uh -huh. In a way you've never seen. Da -da -da -da. Where? Where? Gilson. Where where? Where'd the Gilson? Where is the Gilson? Where where are that? Where the Gilson at? Hmm? Where it at? I don't- The Gilson is real! I don't- I don't- Don't make it much fire! I can't see it! Oh, it's wait so a minute. <laughs> I can leave. Okay, let's see here. Pinch of salt, cocoa powder. Wait, yeah, so my current objective is to make the stuff, right? Hmm. Find out what a Gilson is. Ah! So I just gotta go find it, okay. Oh, hey. What the fuck is a Gilson? <laughs> the machine speaks to me. Somebody said, can we get a full cover? <laughs> Please? Who want one? Is beyond any I mean, if the chat wants it. <laughs> Life and death <laughs> become a thing of the past. Poverty and hunger, a distant memory. I can remake the world anew. But does the world deserve such a gift? For now, I have bigger matters at hand. Said he was from the Gent Corporation. Fortunately, the receptionist knew nothing, and he left quietly. Later, I found his name on the sign-in form. Mr. Alan Gray. Interesting. So the Ooh. Gent Corporation wanted to get the ink machine back, but Wilson... Wilson was panicking to try and do something with it first. Oh, this is nice. Fortunately, you have some scrumptions to satisfy. People will ask you how you made it so fast and come back and smile. Take a loaf of leftover Italian bread. Anything about Gilson? Anything about Gilson? Gilson, Gilson, Gilson. Nope. This doesn't help at all. Thank you, Audrey.
The Gilson fish! This one is a strange little fish that is pretty hard to come by. The Gilson is not known to be easy to catch and will ignore most bait. To make matters worse, the Gilson can move very fast, making it a rare sight. In the end, I was able to snatch me up this little guy with a very clever solution. Apparently, the Gilson is sensitive to sound vibrations and will go into shock upon hearing some sweet music. So crank up the tunes and the fish will be easy to grab. Crush up the Gilson into powder and stir into water for a powerful soothing drink. So, I'm looking for a fish? There's gotta be one here somewhere. Okay, that's weird as hell. Isn't there like a record player somewhere in your room? I yeah, forgot. there was a there was a vinyl record player. Came in to see how you guys are doing. Sweet no tunes. spoilers. How's the game? I'm streaming it tomorrow. This game is literally everything that Bendy had going for it, but better. It is exceptional. I love it to death. Where's my fishy? Where'd the fishy at? I think I actually have to go looking for it. Wait a minute. Gilson, you in there? Gilson? It's so weird seeing an actual reflection still. Okay, I think there's actually somewhere I need to go to find it. This might be the weirdest quest that the game's had me do so far. Right, but, like, it's, it's not unwelcome, it's just strange. Yeah, it's not unwelcome. I'm enjoying it. But it's just one of those things where I'm just like, how did they think... Gilson. Now that's a fish. Give me your Gilson. I know, he, I know he's gonna... Ah, he's yeah. too fast. Time to soothe him with some calming music. Maybe if it was closer. Maybe if we got this piano right up against him. Fish is asleep. Come here, Gilson! I'm gonna rip you apart! You can't get away from me, you little stinker. <coughs> oh. uh, hello. <laughs> I uh, uh, forgot the Gilson again, didn't I? And there's some already ground up in the kitchen, too. Uh, um, I'll be, uh, I'll, I'll bring it up to your room straight away, shall I? <laughs> oh, and uh, maybe you could put Harold back in his tank. <laughs> I hate the dry air. <laughs> Thank you for your super chat of $1. Okay, that was really good. Also, like... That was funny. Also, by the way, just saying, Betty um, wears a mask that covers her face, and she said that Wilson tells her that she was from a long line of, of failures. I think under that mask, she's Alice. Or an Alice. You think? I think under that mask, Betty is Alice. That's a strong prediction, I like that. I think it is, cause like, her face is covered up and she said that she's yeah, from like a long line of failures. Water. One. <laughs> Am I gonna have to sip? I have to, do I have to press E for every sip? I do. Two. <laughs> press E to sip. <laughs> press E to sip, let's go, third sip. Sleepy time. Oh shit, what? 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 Honey. Look at the way she's sitting. Angel. <laughs> Alice. To be exact. That's who I am. 
sent from above, embed in perfection. What do you want? <sighs> right to the chase. I like that. The truth is, honey, you're one of a kind. And to put it bluntly, what I want is your face removed. Oh, that's hot. Peeled away like paper, and your insides torn out and tossed onto my table. Custom parts, ready for my delicious harvest. And with your generous sacrifice, I'll be beautiful. But for now, let's have fun. Plenty of time for a bloodbath later. Ooh. How about a game? Let's all play a game of riddles. Riddles? Oh, what a wonderful idea! No. <sighs> all right, honey. Here's the deal. Behind you is the door to freedom. But it will only be opened if you solve my little puzzle and return to your special chair. Then, I'll throw this heavenly switch here. If you get the puzzle right, you walk away. Get it wrong, you fry. Let's begin. <laughs> Pastor's simping days have begun again. I'm sorry, but like that's a that's a higher that's a higher graphic like that that's that's that. That's a good- that's a good Alice model. Uh-huh. Okay, so there's a puzzle- You wanna, you wanna get closer to her? This is nice. This- this is- this is- Oh, hey. Oh, you're on a date. See, this is way better than whatever that date was in Chapter 3. <laughs> she even made me a donut. So what the hell's the puzzle I'm trying to do here? Yeah. I'm actually done. my face off, Angela Mommy. <laughs> the bird won't have anything to do with the rabbit. Thank you for your super chat. I hear he likes to court danger by sitting next to the fox. The fox thinks the rabbit smells of elderberry. I couldn't see them sitting together. Yeah, better graphics. The yeah. never mm -hmm. sits with the mm -hmm. bird, but he loves the playful company of the bear. Okay, what the hell are these guys trying to tell me? The fox has always hated the bear. They never sit next to each other. My friend the bear always <laughs> sits next to the bird. The background music. Uh, yeah, I know. To school together. Sorry. 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 The puppet fox? Well, he, he wouldn't be cut. Dead sitting on the left. Far too pedestrian. So what is it that I'm trying to do here? Yeah, I have to understand where all the animals sit at the table. Ah, I understand. It's supposed- right. I have to understand the order of them. I have to understand the fox, order. Fox should be on the right. Okay, wait, 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 wait. You said fox should be on the right, the far right? Yes. And the bird, the bird sits with the bear. After all, they went to school together. And the bird does sit um next to the fox. So that that makes sense. Wait, try it this way. Do I have to go talk to her to, um... Yeah, I should- I should save before, um, <laughs> save before I do anything else. A bear, rabbit, bird, and oh. fox. Sounds familiar. Oh my god, yeah! A bear, rabbit, bird, and fox does sound familiar, don't it? Whoa. Oh! <laughs> that does sound familiar!
Hey, um, hey. oh, right, I have to, right, I have to, I have to go sit on my chair, right, um, yeah. And, and, and not your lap, uh, man. Damn, I, y y you know, it, I'll, 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 I'll sit down. Hold on tight, honey. Here it comes. Three, two, one. Oh, did it actually- was that actually the right order? Fuck yeah! I got Damn! It. Could she come back, though? Where- Where'd she go? Could she- could she- could she- You, you know, could she come back? Do you, do you also have a thing for the other mother from Coraline? Okay, no. What? Okay, it depends. They have a similar vibe. Okay, no, but like it. De it depends. Nobody likes a party pooper. You, I, I, I played your game right. Oh hi! Oh, that's no good. Yeah, okay. Dude. Also, what do you mean it depends on which stage she's in? Yeah, like, are we talking about the giant fucking spider, like, like, spider blade monster? Um, just any, any phase of her. It could be any one of them. Well... Uh That's a Yeah, that's um that's a We'll leave it open ended. <laughs> so there is the implication that you do like one of them, but the audience will not know which one. Sure. Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay. We'll okay. go with that. Okay. This is fully charged. As a friend I know which one you like. Uh oh. But I will not tell the audience. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I forgot I could. You. I forgot I could do this. I forgot I could do the big hit. Yeah. Probably could have come in handy sooner. So was Betty actually just straight up Alice Angel like? I'm not sure. Pastor, no wonder you're notoriously bad at games. I literally cannot help it. Yeah, I'm just gonna. I don't understand what they see in Al. Did you see her? Like, I'm sorry, but were we looking at the same woman? Like, hello? 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 Like... Anything you say? <laughs> I've got to sneak up on her. Damn, she's really buttering you up. Yeah, she do be. Stop hiding! Start dying! Damn. Ah! 
Oh! You, you missed me! You don't need my help to be beautiful, you already are! No, you're out there! Is it? Okay, 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 okay. If I'm right underneath... Chad, if it's any concession, I think Alice is hot too. Thank you! Oh my god, thank you! <laughs> Aww. The fuck? She's mocking me, don't feel bad. Where did you go? Okay, I gotta do something with that lift, right? I love how when when you call Alice hot, everybody calls you a simp, and then when I call Alice hot, everybody just says, "Oh, I agree. Good take. Good yeah, take. Alice yeah. would be kind of hot." Yeah, what isn't that hot, guys? Yeah, isn't that isn't that funny, guys? Like, thank thank you for the positive reception, but damn, really doing a motherfucker dirty in these times. Somebody said sadistic Dom who wants my face. Yeah, who doesn't like that? That is literally top tier. <laughs> no, you're out there. The FNAF reference is literally their stage positions from FNAF1. Mine is freaking out. How do I have that memorized? Oh my god, yeah, somebody just pointed out that the order for the puzzle is literally the stage order for the animatronics in FNAF. No. It's Yeah, it's Bonnie, Freddy, Chica, Foxy. It actually was just a full-on FNAF reference in every single way. I don't wanna go. That's fucked. I love that. Okay, I know what I have to do. 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 She's vibing, though. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. When the ink machine is bended, I just got here. <laughs> when the ink machine is bended. I'll scream for you, damn. Uh oh! Where did you go? You hide it. Somebody said no nut November if it'd be tough. Not gonna lie. God damn. After this game? I really love how when you mention Alice, everybody's like, hi, you're just a simp, and then the moment I say she's hot. Everybody's just like, man, no, no, November, finna be hard. Is she a baddie? Yeah, right. You two, you two face motherfuckers. I love you. Wasn't there a platform? Awesome. This is a really cool set piece. It I is. Boy, her Tommy gun. I really like this challenge. It's really, really cool. Especially since the teleportation makes it like a really unique puzzle mechanic. Yeah, it actually plays like a really core, like, big core part of it. I thought there was a platform I was supposed to use to get to her. I don't wanna go! Or was I just supposed to teleport onto that platform with her? Did I, like, completely miss- like, I could've sworn there was a platform I was supposed to go onto. Mm. Am I stupid? As yes. an Arrowways person, I'm so confused. Fucking cool on you for being Arrowways. I am not. Yeah, neither am I. All the respect in the world to you. I am not. Where did you 
Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. As an ROA's person, I'm so confused. Go to the boxes. There are. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, like, I can teleport up here. Hot lady with gun, that's context. Go to the boxes. Stop hiding! Has there been. Stop Wait, have, bo have boxes been getting dropped, like, close to her that I can, like, use to get up there? Because I'm assuming what I'm supposed to do is get up there. To the other side. Okay, the other side. The other side. Thank you. Thank you. We would never hide from you. This is. I'm just trying to progress the game. Shit. Oh, I understand now. Yeah. Right, right, okay. Do I have to... Do I have to banish her? <gasps> oh no. Oh no. No. Oh no. You have a I don't want to. Alice is quite hot. No. Thank you, but I don't want to do it. No. I don't want to do it. It's like shooting a swan. It's like shooting a swan. Stop hiding. Oh no. It's a very violent swan. This is how the game rips out my heart. Hiding from me. Oh. I'm sorry. I have to. It's okay, she could be fine. She could be okay. Right? Yeah! Oh shit, that's bad though. Final curtain, baby. Ooh. Let's blow them away. Oh come on! Twice! Twice in a row, man! We always end up meeting like this. My face. Oh my god, again! Oh, don't do that! Always were. Oh! 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 Why does this feel so familiar? <laughs> Are you all right, Audrey? Alice, I cannot begin to tell you how good it is to see you. Damn, man. And this. Oh, he weight. lost weight. Audrey, meet Tom. He's my protector. My friend. You both got here just in time. Now <laughs> I understand why you don't like being called Alice. The machine creates many of the same forms. <laughs> at least on the outside. On the inside, we're all pretty different. Well, from now on, I'm going to call you something other than Alice. It just doesn't suit you. Oh? What do you have in mind? How about... Alice's son! Alice's son. not bad. Okay, I'll try it out. Alice's son! Only if you can tell me what in heaven's name you're doing in Wilson's retreat. Wilson! I almost forgot! I have to get back right away! Are you crazy? Wilson's our enemy. Do you even know him? Have you ever talked to him? <laughs> seen what he's done. Pastra, interact with thing. Tom. You get a small it reward. Like he has a Thank me later. Okay, I will. For good. And I think he can help us all. I just... I just need to go back and hear him out. Well, if it's true, you'll both need as much help as you can get. The Ink Demon won't go down without a fight. 
Tom and I will gather some of our friends. Tom got ripped though. Good luck, Audrey. Damn. Like Tom, Tom's been lifting. Mind if I take this? Bye, Alice. I'm sorry. I'm so oh god, she's like eyes is glazed over and everything. I'm so sorry. I'm glad you got clarity though. Also, hi Tom. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> oh. Ah. I can pet the boy! I can pet the boy and Allison took the gun! <laughs> Allison's just straight up got a Tommy gun now! Pet him, pet him again. I'm pet him again! Pet the boy! Pet the boy! Pet the boy! <laughs> pet the boy! <laughs> Pet the boy! Pet the boy! Woo! <laughs> That's got me sad, though. <laughs> God, the line always were. Right, that actually hit hard. Wait. Beautiful, beautiful people run this world. If you can have brains or talent, you may just sneak through the gates. But with a pretty face, every door opens. The crowds bow to you. They ask your name. They want you to attend. They ask you to speak. A silky voice with gorgeous lips is every everyone's weak spot. I yeah. Um, I, was I was reborn with my perfection stolen from me. To get it back, I'll rip this rotted world apart. Angels are beautiful. Angels are beautiful. <laughs> That's tragic, man. He's tragic. Don't forget about Big Steve. He hung guy. Big Steve is the least of my worries right now. Demon's voice is so fucking cool. I've been saying it all stream, and I'm never gonna stop saying it. that voice is perfect. Yeah, beat. All right. Oh god. Oh my god. Dude. I'm still gonna murder every single one of those bastards for torturing my little baby boy. Okay. Right, I can't use my blink here. I gotta find another way out. Yeah, I can just straight up jump over. Is there any hiding spots? Okay, okay, okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> I did not I kill Baby Tom's Boy. Just the devs apologizing for killing off Boris in the first game. True. Actually true. Oh god, I hate these freaking keepers. They're terrifying. I can't tell what direction it's looking right now. Oh god, it saw me! It saw me! Oh no! Ah! How do I get away? How do I get away? Oh my god! Oh! Oh! 
How do you like the game so far? Just beat it. It was good. I love this. I love every second of this game. There has not been a single moment in this game I have disliked. Okay, okay, okay. Mmm, bacon soup. Uh, one, starting to wonder if the projectionist was a failed keeper or the other way around. That actually is an interesting idea. Ooh. I've got to go in there and flip that switch. Right, yeah, good idea. I just remembered to save. Yeah. Thank you to whoever in chat just told me to do that. Oh god. I hate them. I hate them so much. Okay, now is a good time. Oh shit! My god, they. Oh my god. Wait, what chapter is this? This is chapter 5. Oh my god. I wonder, because. What do I have to do to get past this place? Alright, that's a battery I need. I can't kill it, guys. It literally insta kills you. Okay, so this leads back around. This leads back around to where I was before. And I need to get- I need to power that battery up. I know- I know, this game does make the first one, like- The first Bendy in the Ink Machine was already- Should have upgraded your health? Nah, I don't regret the upgrades I took. Um, no, like, the, the first Bendy in the Ink Machine was literally my favorite horror game. And yet, this one just is the original, but better in every single way. This is- this is my favorite horror game now. Oh, I can peek? What? Oh, God. What did I miss? Uh, I've just been trying to get past this one keeper so that I can charge my wrench. Got it. No, I don't know what that- Oh, God. I don't know what that- Oh, there's a lever, there's a lever. Is it gone now? Oh, no, it's still there. Oh. They haven't actually I'm, seen me. I am just astonished by how much I've legitimately enjoyed this game. I... This is exactly what I expected it to be. Are you going to change the title and the thumbnail of your Bendy and the Ink Machine video because it's no longer your favorite? No, I'm just going to make a video about the Dark Revival. And say my new favorite horror game. There you go, yeah. Okay, I can't tell if they are still there or not. Are they... Are they just stuck? Did they actually just get stuck? I think they got stuck. Oops. Me when I secure oh. breach. No, okay, okay, they, they got fixed, they got fixed. God, 
hard. Okay, 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 okay. You know, this this game is amazing, but it also makes me a bit sad because this could have been security breach. In many it ways, really it could have been. been. It real, it really could have been. Dear Alice, I don't know if you'll read these notes, but I'll keep leaving them for you. I hope someday you'll understand my words and the madness will fade from your mind. In this strange and dark place, we can find light and purpose. We are not left to wander alone, craving beauty, power, and other meaningless things. Even the heart of someone feeling incomplete can discover joy. We're not lost, we're merely waiting to be found. We are so much alike, formed from the same mold. We're like sisters, you and me. I wish you comfort and the wisdom to let your heart melt into happiness. I won't give up trying to reach you before it's too late, a friend. That was definitely Allison. That's sad. So Alice- Oh, and there's a friggin' weeping mannequin right in front of an Alice cutout. My god. This music box could make a good distraction if I can fix it. And it's the one, it's the Alice music box. That's actually so tragic. Allison literally wanted to try and help Alice to be, like, have more confidence and not constantly strive to, like, you know, just try and be beautiful and just, under like, literally love herself, but she couldn't get through to her before she literally had to kill her. That's so upsetting. Oh, my God. Oh! Oh! Oh, my God! What? That is mean. Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Allison and Susie Alice are gay. There's no hetero explanation for that. But like, they're the same person though! Like, they're literally- like, that- that's literally- I don't know! That- that seems weird to me! That's like- That's like- it's just yourself! Identical twins are a thing, Pastra. Yeah, and they're not gay for each other, are they? You bringing that point up literally just made my point better. I hate the sounds they make. Sounded almost exactly like the gulping sound from Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> You've just constantly got Plants vs. Zombies on the mind recently. It's it's always, it just only comes up when it's relevant. Oh, wait. They said he killed my lord. They said the ink demon fell. They said I was a false prophet, but I say my lord lives. But I say he will return. But I say you better watch your back, Mr. Wilson. Can I get an amen? <gasps> we know who that was, chat, don't we? We know who that was. A boy, Sammy. Chilling in his little jail cell with his fiddle. Banjo, whatever he was playing. I think he was playing a banjo. He was playing a banjo. I, I think he was. I reckon. Can I get an amen in here? That fucking, that song is stuck in my head forever. <laughs> I can't unhear it when I hear that Garden sentence. Garden Warfare 2 Best Class Shooter, don't at me. <laughs> Somebody super chat saying that Garden Warfare 2 is the best class shooter. <laughs> I... A lot of people may find this a controversial opinion, and it's totally okay if you do. But I 
have disdain for anything past the first game just because EA took it over and I feel like any game past one doesn't have the actual like original spirit of one. Ah! I thought I could try and do the whole like banish thingy. Oh god! There is nowhere for me to hide. There was a miracle station right behind me. Okay, how far back did that send me? Okay, right back over here. Clear, right, fall uh, that's a fair opinion, but PVZ2 clears IMO. Okay, gameplay-wise, obviously it's diversified, but the entire soul has been sucked out of it, and it's fucking filled with microtransactions. PVZ2 is a soulless game. Sorry, not sorry. Try that again without getting absolutely obliterated. <sighs> I I won't deny that PVZ two is fun. I'm just saying that it doesn't have like the heart and soul of the original game. Or, or, like, half of the fucking style. Or any of, like, the, the dark humor that was in the original. PVZ1 was, like, okay, this mid-2000s, like, gory, silly horror comedy game. It, it felt like something that you'd play on, like, a, f a Flash website in, like, 2003. Which is weird because it released in 2009. But the game had this this whole like dichotomy going with it that was just sucked out when PVZ2 came along. Because they don't get style, it was just like a pale corporate imitation of the original with more shit added in to fucking contribute to microtransactions. <laughs> hey, Pastra. Will you play Atomic Heart on release? Atomic Heart looks like a cool game, I might. Oh god. Could he please turn a corner? Thank you. Somebody said, did you really just call PVZ dark humor? Yes, Plants vs. Zombies it has this like grim sense of horror comedy to it. It's very funny. Okay. Now I gotta get back to that music box. Do you, do you have any stake in this conversation? Did you ever play the original? I forgot. I played it like one time. I don't really have anything to add to this conversation. Okay, okay. Alright, watch this though. And it's like I was never even there. Yeah. Right, I need another piece. Find the dancing figure, yeah. Also, Angry Birds banger series. Fucking loved Angry Birds. Especially Angry Birds Space. Angry I liked Space Angry Birds. Fucking rocked. I liked Angry Birds yeah! Space too. Let's go. Well, this is unfortunate. Oh, come on!
Brainiac, Maniac, and Loon Boon are low-key bops. Oh. No, those are high-key bops. That's fucking, uh, Laura Shigihara. High-key bops. I mean, she made the fucking main theme of, uh, theme of, uh, Deltarune. Of course those are good. Which, by the way, it's, it's so weird that the person who made Zombies oh. on Your Lawn from fucking Plants vs. Zombies also made the most beautiful fucking song in Deltarune. That is really weird to think about, yeah. <laughs> Brainiac, Maniac, and Loon Boon And the person who sings uh, as the Sunflower, who is also Laura Shigihara, is the one who sings in that song. Oh. So, Deltarune, beautiful <laughs> Sunflower voice. I just like Plants vs. Zombies because of plants. Yeah, you know, the, the song at the end of Deltarune, like... Oh, God damn it. Oh, shit, Miracle oh, shit, Station oh, shit, oh, shit. right behind me that I forgot about again. <laughs> yeah, the the song at the end of Delta Moon, like when the light is running low and the shadows start to grow and the places that you know <laughs> seem like fair to see. That's the fucking sunflower from Plants vs Zombies. She's singing that. That's such a weird thought. Okay, so... Oh. It's got a... Okay, there's nothing here. It's just a butchered dead corpse. Okay. <laughs> Somebody heard my voice and immediately said, GORILLAS?! <laughs> Thank you for using the chat, Creative Mice. And then everybody is saying, Lara, cover when? Okay, where's the... Oh. Lyra sounds kind of like my girlfriend, so it's throwing me for a loop every time she talks. Your girlfriend sounds nice. <laughs> <laughs> Lyra, I seriously want to cover songs from you so bad. I, I, oh wait, I want cover songs from you so bad. I love your singing so much. Thank you. Um. <laughs> okay, that's a hiding spot. Okay, is he coming in here? He is. <laughs> Lyra covering zombies on your lawn. <laughs> oh, I would love to do that. That's so. <laughs> that's funny. God, the creepers are just so creepy still. Yeah, I know the friggin' breathing. It, look, what gets me with these guys breathing is the fact that it sounds like. It sounds like breathing that's trying so hard to be, like, processed through some kind of, like, digital medium. Like, it's constantly, like, lagging and stuttering as if, like, it's struggling to keep up. <laughs> Me, when I rules of the season. Uh oh. Oh Ooh, yeah, Rhinestone Eyes is a good one. Rhinestone Eyes is a very good gorilla song. <laughs> 
Somebody just said we gotta make music with you as the vocals and me as the instruments. <laughs> got to go to bed so I can function at work in the morning. Good luck. Can't wait for the video on this. Thank you so much for being here. I was so glad to. I was so glad to have you. Um, yeah, have a good rest. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh, Guess good sleep. Good night. Good sleep. You ever hear- Has anyone ever wished you a good sleep? Yeah. Like, good sleep. Good sleep. Yeah. Good sleep. I was doing the Saw Goodman, the Better Call Saw theme, and then you went into Rules of the Season. <laughs> Dreams of an insomniac, better call Saul confirmed. Oh my gosh! That's who Clyde called! No way. Okay, watch this though. He didn't even see me, I'm that good. Damn. Damn. Not here. Where was the music box again? Up your F. What? Uh, no, no, no. Okay, it wasn't- it wasn't back here. Whoa! Right. Abilities get disabled here. Did you know you have rights? Well, you do. I love anyway, Saul Goodman. Uh, my name is Saul Goodman. Why am I blinking yes. on- Yes! Somebody got the Shadow the Hedgehog reference! Let's go. Oh, he's Damn. just- he's just Not stuck. Me. Poor guy is just straight up stuck. Well, that's fine by me. Now I just need to find a good place to put it. Actually, Shadow the Hedgehog, um, that whole line is actually been an in-joke in my family since probably, like, from when I was, like, two or three. Because... Oh. My, my awesome trans dad, Ryan, Mr. Bassman, um, he used to play Shadow the Hedgehog on the GameCube, I think, when I was very, very little, and he thought it was fucking hilarious that every time Shadow died, he would say, Damn, not here. <laughs> and so, often, uh, like at inopportune times, my, my, um, like Ryan would say that, and I ended up picking it up, and little me would go, "Damn, not you!" <laughs> <laughs> and so as I grew up, I thought it was funnier and funnier. And they always told me it was from Shadow the Hedgehog, and now I I fucking love that game, and it's so funny because I it's it's that line has been in my life since I was like three or four. This is unfortunate. I'm okay! What's your opinion on pretzels? I like pretzels, specifically soft pretzels. Hell yeah! Somebody in chat asked you that, I hope they're happy. They should definitely be happy. Okay. Oh! They're not distracted now, Mark! Y'all come back here. There's been a lot of really fucking close calls, like, all stream. Oh, and I've been seen. I still find it funny that even though our stream cut out and we've been through so many trials and tribulations and it's really late, we have, like, 1,487 people watching right now. The lowest number of concurrence we have had this stream has been... 1.3 thousand. That has been the lowest number of concurrence we have had. This has probably been my most successful stream I've ever done. The only God stream- damn. The only stream I have ever done that has gotten higher numbers than this was my original Bendy and the Ink Machine stream. The first stream I ever did. Whew. 
literally, like, it's so weird. Almost everything I have done related to Bendy and the Ink Machine has been, like, monumental for my channel, and that just makes the series even more special to me than it already is. Like, yeah. Oh, right, because Star Trek here. dudes are so cool. I love the them keepers. so much. The keepers are such cool enemies. I love these guys. Let me out! Let me out! Oh, I'm okay. I'm okay. They can't go through these. Oh my god. Oh, okay, so she wasn't Alice Angel. Alice just snuck in. But I think she's a Alice. There you are, thank goodness. Wilson's waiting for you downstairs in the laboratory when you're ready. But first, can I get your help with something? Just a moment, just a moment. Yes. <laughs> Normally, I wouldn't ask this of a guest, but... Oh, with all that's happening, I can't sneak out and get things like I usually do. Do you think you could pop round to the farmer's market back in town and find me a few ingredients? We're running quite low in the kitchen, and I was hoping we could all celebrate tonight with a lovely supper. Won't take but a moment if you go by train. Up to you. <laughs> no pressure. Subway, when you need to travel, take the train. Catch the subway when you need to travel between Wilson's Retreat and downtown. The next train is always on time. Head to the farmer's market! Why did I... Why did I go down the stairs like I would... Why does Audrey fall down the stairs? Like, Audrey's legs become spaghetti when she... Like, look at the... Like, why does Audrey run down the stairs like her legs are literally in the process of breaking? Like, why do her anchor ankles, like, bend backwards? She's like, oh yeah, I'll go get that from the farmer's market. God. She has heels? Okay, yeah, sprinting down the stairs with heels would probably look like that. Alright, let's go to the farmer's market. Oh, these stairs are fine. It's just specifically Wilson's stairs that are fucky. So... I have to wait for the subway to come? Is that what it wants? Well, I mean, it is pretty decent. I would recommend it. It's like a- it's a pretty okay meal. Subway? Yeah. I have been eating so much Subway this week, you have no idea. Everybody in my family hates Subway, so I never get to eat it. I always order Subway when I want something to eat. It's probably because they actually have gluten-free friendly options for your sickly ass. Yeah, exactly. They got that spongy ass bread that I can actually eat. Mmm... Bread... I like me going and doing grocery shopping as part of the horror game experience. If you and me ever meet up, we gotta do, like, a grocery shopping stream. That would be hell for people to watch. I'm all for it, and, though. And for people in real life to experience, imagine us two idiots fucking walking around with a camera. Oh, God. Wait, can I just... Oh, no, he saw me. I really do hope we meet up someday. I would, Some... I would be sad as hell if that didn't happen. Someday. Someday. Some beautiful day. Where's the farmer's market? This is not the farmer's market. Is that the farmer's market? Are you the farmer's market? You're not the farmer's market. Where's the farmer's market? Amazing. Heavenly toys. Lyra, Great Shadow stuff. the Hedgehog versus Clyde, who would win? I think Clyde. I mean, Shadow has guns, that's awesome, but like, Clyde has a Clyde. Shadow punches Clyde. It does decent damage, but Shadow dies because he punched Clyde. Exactly. There we go, I got my stuff from the farmer's market. It seems that this was an enemy I couldn't touch. Damn. Ugh. Ugh. He just dies. <laughs> Literally see him condensing before your eyes. God damn it. I'm fucking dying. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, Sonic, what was that thing? Jesus Christ, Sonic, what did you put in the park? Also, once again, we love that Metroidvania-esque level design where I can actually just come back to an old location and open up a shortcut to quickly access an another area. Literally what happens to Shadow in the Metal Virus arc- oh, okay, actually, yeah, that is just straight up Shadow in the Metal Virus arc. Big Steve. Big Steve! We're not feeding Big Steve right now. Lemon. Lemon. <laughs> Lemon. Clyde <laughs> versus Big Steve. I don't know if, if, I mean, they're made out of ink. I don't, I don't know how Clyde affects ink. He grabs Big Steve and starts doodling You're a big a picture with him. Worker. Oh, truly. Oh, I only wish there was something I could do for you. Oh, wait. I spotted something in the fountain yesterday. Don't know what it's for, but you're welcome to have it. You better go see Wilson downstairs. He's been waiting ages. What's in the fountain for me? What's in your big ass ink fountain? It's a mug. With a little frowny face on it. I'm assuming you've got to collect all these random items to get the good ending. Yeah, we gotta collect all the memories to get a good ending, I'm assuming, is what's gonna end up happening. Now, where's the laboratory? The laboratory! The laboratory! <laughs> Audrey, welcome to my laboratory, where we do good things! Very good things! I am the good guy! Everyone loves me here, Audrey. Everyone loves me. Rise and shine, Mrs. Drew. Rise and shine. Now that you mention it, he does kind of talk like G-Man. Okay, he where's does. the laboratory? Oh, that's the, uh, that's the conservatory. That is the library. Where's the laboratory? The laboratory! Wilson knows your purpose! That's not like a really creepy and sus red flag of a message. I think Wilson's the good guy. Oh, he's got the magic. Oh, my eyes! Oh, that actually plays like a flashbang. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't. All this, time, all this time, chat was flashbanging you. Also, color. Yeah, right? Color in the cycle. What the fuck's that doing there? What the fuck is that doing That's- so many chats said the LGBTQ juice. Oh, this is so weird, what the fuck? Damn. It's so weird seeing this much color in the Bendy universe. It's a cool fucking set piece, though. Oh, it is. Look at all this colored paint, what the hell? Oh, god, it's all becoming colorful. <laughs> Yes, Technicolor. It's Technicolor. Okay, so this is this is literally the go back and do stuff in the game you may have missed before we get to the ending. It, however, is close to is uh, two fifteen in the morning, and I would very much so just like to get to the end of the game uh, during this stream. So I'll go back on my own time. The ink demon is a formidable foe. To truly destroy such a monster, he must be dethroned, humiliated. For months now, I've been working on something that will do exactly that. Cast out the demon, and put a new deity in his place. Stronger, more powerful, and controllable. Was Amok foreshadowing this? Me to unleash our ultimate uh -huh. weapon. Come, let me show you my creation. What the f- 
simple but elegant. Ship ahoy, Dudley! Powerful beyond anyone. Oh, he's such a nerd! And we can have peace at last. He's such a nerd! It could work, but it sounds risky. How will we control him? We don't want to repeat Joey's mistake. No, we don't. All of the factors must be perfect. The right design, the right science, and the right soul. At last your purpose is revealed, Audrey. This is why you're here. With your soul inside him, my creation will live forever. Stay away from me. You're insane. Come now, Audrey. Part of you knew this was Kick him into it. Kick him into it. Kick him into it. And ascend. I thought you said we needed to save your father. I thought you had a plan to send me home. To make everything right. I lied. My father is beyond hope. Perhaps you know him. Nathan Arch. Oh! Owner of Archgate. Industrial genius. Business tycoon. Oh shit! For years I've lived in his reaching shadow. He always had time for the grand creatives of the world, the doers, as he called them. He knew only the best, the biggest thinkers. How could his lonely son ever hope to compete with that? Oh, so he has an inferiority now, complex. Okay. Thanks to you. No need to struggle. My signal prevents you from using those devilish powers of yours. And more importantly, it keeps the ink demon from getting in. It's time to die, Audrey. And live again as a god. No. Not this time. Push him in! Push him in! Yeah! Yeah! Fuck him up! Get destroyed! Woo! He's nothing but a puddle! Oh my god! Wow! We really did kick his ass! That's dark. Wow! Shit, man! Get fucked! Fuck. Get destroyed! Get actually destroyed, you fucking nerd! I ain't gonna be your little ships ahoy, little little sailor boy. Get obliterated! You're nothing but a puddle. Final boss, one hundred percent, is gonna be like a monstrous, awful version of that stupid little nerdy character. Yeah. Okay. Like, yeah, his soul's gonna be going into that now, right? Yeah. Which means it's gonna be awful. It's gonna be horrendous, ugly. Ugly man. I mean, he already was ugly. I it's an awful design. Wils, like, his... Like, Wilson as a character is very interesting, though. No, knowing that, like, his whole reason for doing all of this is literally because, like... Because, like, throughout the entire game, we, we read all those tapes from his father, who owns Archgate, and he always seemed like such, like, a visionary and such an ambitious person. Like, that's the kind of person that you could imagine building this entire sort of, um... This entire sort of empire of what he's doing. So for Wilson to be this like Wilson in the gear machine. Wilson in the gear machine. But no, like for Wilson to grow up in someone like that shadow, like he's very clearly gonna want to build something bigger and better. So when he finds the ink machine, seeing that as the opportunity to be his father when his in the real world he's nothing, like that that actually like Wilson's a cool villain. I like Wilson a lot. Oh hey, and look at that, there's a tape from his dad. Life has 
has other value. I think I'll go home early today. Maybe I'll even pick up a hot dog for Tessa. See, like, that's the thing. Nathan Arch is a is just a good man. Like, you can tell from all the tapes, he's not like Joey Drew. He actually is just a good person. So for Wilson to, you know, despise him and envy him, like, he's literally living in the shadow of somebody who, like, isn't even really, like, villainous or evil. He's, like, Wilson is just this nasty, just, like, ball of envy that can't handle being in the shadow of somebody like that who's like a real visionary. Wilson, Wilson's a cool villain. I like Wilson a lot. Also, this creepy-ass hallway. Better villain than Vanny. Oh, leaps and bounds better. Oh, hey, it's the ink machine. Vanny isn't even a character. Benny is not a character at all. You oh my god. The ink machine's from Benny and the ink machine. Or it's time to ask a question. Okay, this, the leg is definitely not in the actual... The, the leg is definitely not intentional from the audio. Time to ask the question. Your mic, your mic keeps doing this really weird popping. Weird. Oh my god! You were right! Yep. Wilson's inside of the fucking scoops, ahoy boy! Oh, that looks awesome! Oh my god, they were in for like an actual fight here. Okay, we've got to charge it, right? Fully charged gen pipe. Re okay, so I gotta fully charge it. Oh, do I have to get him to like try and hit one of these? Oh, he looks so good. Yeah, I do. This is a kick ass design. Holy crap. Oh god, the boss is a Sailor Boy Spider Lankman. Sailor Boy Spider Lankman? Where's the thing to charge it, though? God, I actually love the way this monster looks. Holy shit. Okay, okay. Right, right, here's the- here it is, here it is. Okay. Okay, okay. Wait for him to swing, wait for him to swing. Okay, now while he's pulling back. Right, okay, okay. Rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. Okay, okay, okay. Let him... Okay, gotta get our stamina recharge. Okay, now we take this opportunity. Go, 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 go. Okay, 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 okay. Swing! Okay, tar power this down. Oh, shoot, he's actually... Oh, fuck. Ow, he's actually just throwing shit at me. God, this fight's cool. I like this a lot. God damn. Okay, okay, okay. Power it down. Ow! Okay, 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 wait. I wanna wait, I wanna wait for him. I wanna wait for him. Okay, my, my, okay, my pipe is not fully recharged yet. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, alright. Swing your big ol' anchor at me, boy! There you go.
Ow. Come on, blink, blink, blink. Oh. Oh, shit. What's he doing now? Oh, God. Oh, he hit himself. Oh, God. Wilson's head's fucking sticking out of it. Oh. God, I just noticed Wilson's actual, like, fucking, like, corpse sticking out of this thing's body. That's fucking terrifying. Oh, this is a cool final boss. This is a sick ass design. I love this dude. Oh my yeah, Wilson, um I I killed Wilson in a machine that was supposed to put my soul into that monster. And because Wilson went into it instead of me, now Wilson is that monster. Like, oh my god. It's Bendy and the Ink Machine in a way you have never seen. Is this the Dark Revival? He literally has Lankman eyes. You know, I didn't find a single design in the original game, like, creepy. But, like, so many other designs in this new game are, like, really eerie in a cool way. They really are! Like, that fucking Ghost Butcher Gang member! Yeah! And this guy, and the Keepers, and, and, uh, the, the little maid Betty. Um... Everybody. Oh, this game, in every single way, was worth the years of wait. Yeah. I really thought that this, like, what, before they announced it, I really thought this game was, like, less than halfway to development, that they ran out of money to make it, that, like, it, it was in development in hell, because of lawsuits and shit. No, this game is done. This game is, like, done so, and it's fucking... Rocks, dude. It rocks so much. I can forgive every okay. shitty thing about the first Bendy game because this game is just. I love this. It's it's obviously probably not gonna be like perfect in retrospect, but I don't care because I just love this thing. This is this is legitimately a really cool game. Literally me with the first Bendy. Okay, okay, I'm at full health now. We just gotta stick away from him now. God, this fucking design. Okay, okay, now this is where I actually hit Wilson Wilson. In this fucking creepy ass visual, Jesus.
Okay, 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 okay. No way. Ow! Okay, 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 okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. We just can't get greedy. Just don't get greedy. Just don't get greedy. Just don't get greedy. It's such a weird sound that happens when you hit him. I know. It's so... I don't even know what that sound is supposed to be. Oh, ow. There we go. We did it. God, my legs! Oh, the Ink Demon! Oh shit! Oh my God! Oh, he's fucking killing him! Let's go! Oh my God! Whoa. Rip him apart, Bendy! The fuck happened to your legs? I, I didn't see. He ripped them off before trying to kill me. Oh my God! Whoa! Oh God! I, I am Bendy! I'm from Bendy's POV now! There's always a choice. I know you're in there. What? Deep behind that evil face. Inside somewhere is my little girl. My Audrey. My greatest creation. I'm scared. I, I don't know what's happened. The past doesn't define you. Nor the present. In the end, all those years ago, Joey Drew finally succeeded. He created life. But Audrey, you're so much more than that. You were his family. His daughter. My daughter. And I love you so very much. Be quiet. The rich is Remember who you are, Audrey. Remember. Your words are waste. Just a 
That's what you dream. That's not enough. You have to have heart. Oh shit! Oh, please. It's the end credits music! Oh. Oh. I'm scared. Oh, I'm, I'm scared. so scared. I'm so scared. Oh, Beast Bendy! Oh, and he looks fucking cool! What? Whoa. I'm playing as Bendy! What? I'm playing as Bendy! Holy shit! This is so cool! What? What the fuck? I am Bendy! Oh, there it is. Oh my god! What the hell, dude? Dead end. 
Now what? Need some help? Henry! You came! <gasps> Henry! Even a million times. Come on. I found a projector up ahead. Run for it. fan service. <laughs> the end. <gasps> is that is that the projectionist's head? That is the projectionist's head. came together for one final fight <sighs> everyone everyone sammy allison tom henry porter Whoa. Oh. we're back to the beginning my father once told me. Oh my god. That just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it. Oh my god, and the. We're always free to The choose. message from the start suddenly makes sense with the context of it being Joey. The very beginning. And she went back in a loop. My father's cartoon world was now mine. <gasps> to rule, to watch over, and to protect. Oh. I can make the cycle more bearable for my friends inside. But as for me, I'm the first of my kind. Born of ink, but living in flesh. Joey's world is escaping into ours. So, what's next? My boy. I actually feel like I'm about to cry right now. I forgot that the meat was first Henry. <laughs> oh my god. I actually feel like I'm about to cry right now. I have goosebumps all over- oh! They took the ink machine. They took the ink machine. They took my fucking eyes. They actually took the ink machine. Gent has the Oh. Oh. Oh my god. That That, that... Oh my, I'm actually getting tears in my eyes, chat. <laughs>
Whoa. Oh my god, it's actually over. This was a wonderful stream. Glad I could be here. Thank you for being here. Extra games with the GG in chat. Fucking wow. I... I... I don't even know what to say, guys. That was... That was so... Ugh. Seeing Henry at the end... Ugh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> no mic mood in the credits. Glad you enjoyed the ending. I loved it, Etra. What the fuck happened with Mike Mood anyway? He was an asshole. He was ah. he was the one who mistreated like a lot of the people. Uh, wow. <laughs> Just oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Wow. <laughs> so chat Chat, that That was Bendy in the Dark Revival, chat. Greatest horror oh. game of all time, glad you beat it. Oh my god. Chat that I can't believe I actually got to experience this. I like holy shit. This I I loved the original <laughs> Bendy and the Ink Machine. The boy is back. <laughs> we didn't get into a loop. We beat Bendy again. All that is left is to 100%, right? Well, good stream, good night, and repellous. Thank you so much. That's all that's left to 100%, but like... Guys, like, I... Listen, like, you... I loved the original Bendy and the Ink Machine with all my heart. All of its flaws, all of its problems, all of its rocky history aside. That first original Bendy and the Ink Machine was something that was so, so special to me. It was my favorite horror game I played. It was the first game I managed to get all the achievements in. It was really special. And this, this was everything I could have possibly hoped for in a single well-made package. It, it took everything. Everything I loved about the original game and just made it even better and it took all the problems I had with it and it Just basically made them non-existent. Does this game have problems? Maybe. Maybe it does. Maybe this is my bias speaking but like this Was literally just my favorite horror game my favorite experience I've had playing a horror game ever <laughs> and it's just that Holy heck, but this is literally the best game I've literally seen. better Plus, in no every single way explain the silent delay for this game yeah honestly it's justified but like holy shit Corey, my let's go this was literally everything i loved about bendy and the ink machine a video a game i was willing to make an almost 2 hour video explaining my love for and it's just that but improved. I so, went from I went from thinking that this game was never coming out to have experienced this. Three hour video on Dark Revival? <laughs> However long it ends up being, cause like this Like Oh my god. Is there a way to what happens if I could continue? Wow. Like, this... This was... This was literally everything I could have possibly wanted from a Bendy sequel. 
I was always so scared that we were never going to get this game, that this game wasn't going to live up to my own expectations, that this, that this wasn't going to be something that lived up to what I loved about the original, but somehow, somehow, it delivered. It had, it had fan service that felt right. It didn't feel forced. <laughs> it had Holland. an exceptional story. The art style was beautiful. The characters were explored so deeply. Like, okay, yeah, we're just back at the, we're just back at the final boss. We're just back at the final boss. Okay. But like, I literally couldn't have asked for a better experience. And mind you too, to add on to how special this experience has been for me. The chat! The chat! What? The chat! Oh my god! Hi! Oh, thank you so much for playing! This game was made with so much love and care over the last few years just for you all. Thank you! Oh my god! I wasn't expecting to see you in the chat! Oh my god! Thank you! Thank you! Okay, listen! The ma thank you for making this! Thank you for sending- Thank you for giving me a free copy of this! Thank you! This was well worth the wait! Listen, I don't care what anyone else says about this game. If you're hearing it from me, and nobody else, this game is fucking amazing. This is my new favorite horror game I've ever played. You and everyone else behind this game should pat yourselves on the back. You have made something that you really, truly deserve to be proud of. This is an I, amazing experience. I'll be honest and say that I went into the experience cautiously optimistic, but I have come out absolutely blown away. Thank you so much for putting in the time and going through the hardship that was required to make something like this. I am truly happy that I got to attend the stream, that I got to watch Zach play this game. I'm just, my mind is legitimately blown. This is phenomenal. Meatly, thank you. Like, I don't know what From other people- bottom of my heart, thank you. I don't know what other people's opinions are going to be when, when, you know, I see, uh, like, other people playing this game. But no matter what other people say, this was something special. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to pick this game apart and try to get every single, like, completionist route for it. Also, we got a super chat. Sammy appears, praises Bendy, refuses to elaborate, dies. Love that Sammy Lawrence appearance. <laughs> Yeah, wow. dude, oh my god, everything, like, all of the fan service in this game had me screaming, dude. Henry at the oh end actually had fucking tears in my eyes, seeing him actually there, seeing him! I just, yeah, this was worth the wait. Incredibly worth the wait. I, I'm still trying to process what I just, like, came through. That, this was Bendy in the Dark Revival. A game, like I said, that I was fearing for the release of, and yet here we are, having finished streaming it. And I'm just, I'm absolutely floored by it. Everything, everything, everything just worked. And here we are now at wow. the end of it, and... I don't, I don't even know what to say anymore. It's just... I guess... Wow. I guess, like... <laughs> Thank you, Pastor. I love this game, and I'm so happy for, to be on the Bendy Ooh. high again. Me too, man. Bendy you know, is back. Meatly, if you're still here Bendy's and you're back. still watching, <laughs> I know that I just watched Zach play through this entire thing, but as soon as I get my next paycheck, I'm buying this on Steam and supporting you. <laughs> Because holy fuck, does it seem like you put so much into this, and you have me on board. Oh my god. I'm buying the shit out of this, I'm telling other people to buy the shit out of this. I am just, wow. Just wow. See chat? How much is the game? I, I'll have to check. I. I'll, I'll have to I check. I, I, I got it for free, so I actually didn't even see the price tag that was on this. Just... wow. Bending in the Dark Revival is $34.
good price. Honestly, good price for the amount of fucking phenomenal content that this game has to offer. That's crazy. Well, I mean, unless there's anything else to be said, I think that's the end of the stream, guys. I think we've... I'm emotional. Me too! Me too! Like... I was not ready. I was not ready for how much... Like, obviously I thought I was gonna like this, but like, Jesus. When I got to the end and I was controlling Beast Bendy, that was- that's- that's something I'm never gonna forget experiencing for the first time. You know what? Yeah, if- well, if- uh... if that's it, unless you have any- any thought- like, closing thoughts of your own, I feel like I've expressed my feelings on this game and just the experience of it, so... Do you, do you have any do you have any closing thoughts? Until we meet again, thank you. Until th we meet again, thank I know you. exactly what that implies. Thank you again, Meatly. I'm looking forward to whatever you and your team end up coming up with again. I will always be here for it. Thank my you. My thoughts are my thoughts are Pastra, Meatly, everybody on the team of this game. Y'all made me Bendy fans. For real, for real. Y'all <laughs> brought back that magic that I felt back in 2017 when I was first seeing drummings of the game. And I can't wait for whatever magic comes next. I am really emotional right now. This has been a wild ride. Thanks for, for everybody who stuck around. Love y'all. For real, for real. Thank you all so much for being here for the whole thing. This has probably been my most successful stream ever. And I would have had it no other way. I, do, I don't think I would have wanted it to be any other game that I could consider my most successful stream. This and last night's stream were crazy. It has been such a wild ride. I have streamed so much these last two days. And I don't even feel drained or exhausted. I feel so energetic. Thank you for everyone who's been here. Thank you for all the donations. Thank you for everyone who stuck through for however long this was with the little hiccup we had with the crash and everything. Thank you for everyone who stuck through in the stream last night. And seriously, thank you, Meatly, and everyone else behind your team for making this. This experience just made me happy. I have never been so invested in like a stream or a game in a very long time. I'm happy that I got to experience it with all of you guys, and I'm happy that I have an audience that I'm able to express this much enthusiasm for, you know? Like, I feel like I've been sitting here and I've been sharing in this excitement with so many other people, and like, without this audience, without this channel, I feel like I wouldn't be able to share this nearly as much as I have been. Like, Thank you all for being here. Thank you all for ex experiencing this game with me. It's been a wild ride, and I can't wait to make as many videos on this game and other Bendy games <laughs> in the future as I can. When next stream? Next stream is whenever the hell. I'm not sure, but... <sighs> Thank you all for being here for this one and last night. It's been a wild ride. I'm so happy to have seen that we were all a part of it. But we're gonna we're gonna get going for now. And I'll talk to you all. I'll see you all soon. Yeah, I'll see you guys soon. I just gotta finish crying. <laughs> Fuck. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, Meatly, if you're still here. Goodbye.